All right, Shalom. First off, I want to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shai, Ba'ashem, Rekha I want to give double honors to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone. And this is here, Shalom to all the Akim out here that's doing and pushing the work in truth and in sincerity. Okay, I'm going to do a little response video, okay? I, she, BK, and their endless genealogies. Okay, um, this is a response video to, um, you know, when we was out at camp, uh, our camp page is GMS Baltimore Works, okay, but when we was at camp, an ISUBK member came up and, uh, we drew him in for a debate, okay, and, um, I'm gonna just play some of the, uh, video Okay, because um, in this video, the guy was uh, just making it seem like uh, skin color mattered, okay, and that you had to um, basically ask a person what their, um, what their uh, father is, okay, in order to know what tribe they're, they're from, okay. So um, I'm going to play this. Yeah, nobody is is a black Hebrew Israelite, okay? Black means death. The word black means void of color. Okay? There's no such thing as black. That car is black. Nobody looks like that car, man. No, okay? Nobody. The Arabs are darker than you. And they would never say that Israelite. Okay. So, um,. I'm going to look up dark-skinned East Indians. Okay, some of these people are just as dark as our people. Okay, like this guy, for example. Okay, a dark-skinned man. Okay, but he'll never say that he's a black man. Okay. These people have melanin, okay? But what he said in the video, he said they're not his brothers, which we, we agree they're not our brothers, but we also say that our people can look like them, okay? You have some Israelites who are going to look like all these different nations, okay? Continuing on in the video. Yeah, the <laughs> uh, Africans. Okay, they're just as dark, also. Now, the word African just means. It, it comes from Scipio Africanus, okay, which is a so-called white man, okay? So, this person, okay, <laughs> you'll sit up there and you'll look at them and you see melanin, okay? But we know through the spirit that this is not, just because they're black, that they're not the same people. All black people are not the same. But ISUBK, they don't understand that. They look at it, oh, you're, you're a black man in America? Well, then more than likely, or you're from America, then more than likely you're an um, Israelite. Okay? But once again, it's all about the spirit. Okay? It's not about what your, you know, your father and your father's father, you know, it's not, it, it is about that, but that, that, right there um i'm gonna get into that that uh point okay but i'm gonna continue on so these guys basically are just basing everything off of what for what a person's skin color um is hey, let's, let's read this. 
So he said that, uh, hold on, because he didn't want to answer the question that was uh, posed to him. Okay, the scripture said, my inheritance is like unto me like a speckled bird. Okay, and a speckled bird, okay, looks different. It has different colors. Okay. Now, there's many scriptures that go into how the Israelites are going to look like different um have different skin colors and everything like that okay um you have a lot of these people that think that all of the israelites are just negro okay like um icpk now they also got this uh because he he said in the video that uh you have to act because we, we asked uh, uh, a woman had walked by and a brother had asked you know, with that lady, could she possibly be an uh, Israelite? So he said, "You, do, I don't know." You, ha he said, "No," off top. But then he said, "You also have to ask her father and her father's father." Okay, which both of the fathers could be um, have uh, skin color. Now I'm gonna get this scripture, and you, you know, you can watch this video. Okay, um, this is uh, First Timothy one and four. It says, um, neither give heed to fables, okay, because that's all these guys do, okay, at ICPK. They, uh, they, they, they do fables, okay, they, they teach fables, okay, a lot of fables. So it says, uh, and endless genealogies, asking what your father and father's father is, okay. Cause I had asked him what uh what tribe he was from, and um he told me he was from the tribe of Gad. So it's like, how do you know that? This this is all based off of faith. You don't have your information of your 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 fathers and your father's fathers dating back onto who the uh, tribe of Gad are. Okay, biblically. Okay, especially when the the tribe of Gad left um the land of uh, Israel and came over here to America. Okay? So, um, continuing on, um, it says, uh, neither give heed to fables and en endless genealogies. Okay? It says, a record of descent or lineage. Okay? And that's what they uh, if if you came up to ICPK and you had any color skin or whatever, then they're gonna ask you, "Hey, what's your father's father?" And you know, "What's your father's father's father?" Okay, that's an endless genealogy. Okay, and the the point is that brothers was was making in the video is what if you don't know your father? Okay, it says which minister questions. Rather than godly edifying, which is in faith. Okay, so when we uplift the people, okay, that, that hear this, this message, we supposed to be uplifting them in, in the faith, okay? Now, what is faith? Hebrews 11 and 1. Faith, now, faith is the substance of things hoped for, the evidence of things not seen. You can't see that you're, you're an uh, Israelite. You know, you just have, have faith, okay? Yeah, you know, like, when you look in the, the, the mirror, what you may look like, but we look at life through a first-person point of view. So you don't, you can't tell by yourself unless somebody looked at you and just straight up told you, yeah, man, you're an Israelite, you know, and this, this, this word resonates with you, okay? Because that's what is really, that's what, what really happens, okay? This, uh, this word is uh it resonates with you okay romans 8 and 16 the spirit itself bears witness with our spirit that we are the children of your okay so so 
when you have other brothers who, you know, looking at, at life, they looking at life from a first person point of view, and their spirit, okay, resonates with our spirit, okay? And and that's one way how we know that we are the, the children of, of Yahweh Bashim Yahshah. Because he was in, in the video, he was talking about if you guys had a white man with you, y'all guys would, would, would uh, be with him. Or, or he'll, he'll be allowed to join your, your camp. See, in their eyes, they looking at it like it's just a, a so-called white man. But on the inside of that so-called white man, okay, that's that's the spirit of an Israelite. Because we're not going to have uh, no no uh, Edomite that's, that's with us, man. Okay? It's not no white and black thing. Okay, with this this uh, word. So these guys at ISPK, they're not spiritual. Okay. So um, continuing on, First Timothy six and three. If any man teach otherwise, okay, which these guys do, they teach otherwise, and he had a whole feminine spirit on him. Okay, different doctrine. Okay, and and consent not to wholesome words, even the words of our Lord Yahweh Shah. Okay, because we was trying to bring out scriptures and trying to make points, but he just wanted to um to argue, okay? And to the doctrine which is according to godliness, okay, which is righteousness, okay, he is proud knowing nothing. Okay, so when I asked him what do a speckled bird look like, he couldn't answer that. Okay, he, he didn't know. You know, he had a phone in his hand, as you can clearly see. He had a phone. But why didn't he why didn't he Google it? Okay? It says, but doting about questions and stripes of words. Okay? Because he made a so big deal. He made a big deal over, you know, when we were saying black and and stuff like that. You know? So so this guy doesn't know anything. He's proud because that's what uh uh, SBK teach it says whereof cometh en envy, strife, railings, and evil surmisings. Okay, and it got to the point where he started saying bitch ass niggas, and you know, the um got one of the brothers in the camp. You know, he was mad. You know, but um, it says perverse disputants of men of corrupt minds and destitute of the truth. Supposing that gain is godliness, and this is all I should be K. From such, withdraw thyself, okay? So we're not really supposed to be dealing with I should be K or trying to come up together with I should be K because they, they teach a totally different doctrine, you know? Which is different than what the scriptures uh, teach, okay? So, um, continuing on, Jeremiah 17 and 4. It says, And thou... Even thyself shall discontinue from your heritage that I gave you. So the scripture said our heritage is like a speckled bird. And uh, Jeremiah 12 and 9, right? That the Lord's heritage is unto him as a speckled bird. Okay, once again, a speckled bird. Okay, this is what it will look like. Okay. Ain't going to just see no straight up black speckled bird. Okay, it's written there for a reason. Okay, um, continuing on, it says, And I will cause you to serve your enemies and the land which thou knowest not. And one way of our, how our people discontinue from their heritage, you're not going to know who you are, man. Okay, but by the Spirit. Okay, you have people out here that like to go into these um, ancestry. DNA Ancestry and Ancestry.com, okay? But those things are just scams, man, okay? It says uh, DMA, DNA Ancestry testing is a scam, but claims that this analysis will tell you much about where you came from are, are downright fraudulent, okay? This is an article. No one even audits the results of these tests. For all you know, some guy is sitting in his sorts and writing the results for you based on his imagination. Okay? Uh, continuing on. Telling you that you share some genes with everyone from Siberia to South America is not really worth your money. Or worth the money. You have, you know, some of these ancestry 
places that like to say, oh, you got to uh, put money in. Okay, and that, that a lot of our heritage was, was lost. Okay? In slavery. That, that, uh, when that, when that, um, when that child, okay, was taken away from, from their mother, okay, is the, the scripture in, uh, Deuteronomy, um, 28, and, uh, Thirty-two, your sons and your daughters shall be given unto another people, and your eyes shall look and fail with longing for them all the day long, and there shall be no might in your eye, your hand. Okay, and slavery and in today, what if a child is in foster care, man? How are they going to know who their parents are? Okay, we lost our heritage. Okay. So it says, in fact, there's more variation within populations of people than between them. Okay? It says, nobody can cite a single actual scientific review that validates the results from these ancestry tracing tests. Okay? And, and nowadays, you might sit up there and say, oh, you know, such and such is my father. But the whole time, that's not even your father, man. Your mother done, done stepped out, you know? So you can't go by oh, what the person father looks like, okay? Because we discontinue from our heritage, okay? And now, and that's all, all of our people, man, okay? Even the ones that going to look like a so-called white man or so-called Chinese man or so-called East Indian, Okay? It says, uh, and I will cause you to serve your enemies in the land which thou knowest not. For you have kindled a fire in mine anger, which shall burn forever. This is Daniel 9 and 7. O Lord, righteousness belongs unto you, but unto us confusion of faces. Because you're not going to know who, who the, um, you know, you got to go by the spirit of, of what an what a Israelite is, who an Israelite is, man. Okay, and once again. Because we kept on bringing this point out that it's, the, it's about the spirit, man, not not the flesh, okay? It says the spirit bears itself, bears witness with our spirit that we are the children of Yahweh by Simeon Sah, okay? So if a man that looks like a so-called white man, okay, and his spirit, it resonates with us, okay? What's the word resonate? Look that word up. Produce or be filled with a deep, full, reverberating sound. Okay. And 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 it takes that that oh it says to relate har harmoniously. Okay, to strike a chord, which means to agree. Okay. Har harmoniously means to agree. Okay. So so when we and I did a video yesterday. Okay, about about the word harmony. Okay, was uh the word harmony once again means agree. Okay, so when you see a, a man, okay, that that or a woman that um agrees exactly what 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 we're teaching, especially here at Great Millstone, then more than likely that's an Israelite man. That that's a confusion of faces. It says as at this this day. To the men of Judah and to the inhabitants of Jerusalem and unto Israel, all Israel, okay? So all of the Israelites, period, point blank, simple, okay? Are going to have confusion of faces amongst them, okay? Meaning our people are going to look like these other nations. And guess what? The so-called white man going to look like these other nations too, Okay? It says that are near and that are far off, okay, in these other countries. It said, oh, it says through all the countries where the thou hast driven them. Because of their trespass that they have trespassed against you, okay. So when we call out our people, okay, 
we we calling out for the elect first and foremost. This is Baruch two and twenty nine. If you will not hear my voice, surely this very great multitude shall be turned into a small number among the nations, where I will scatter them. For I knew that they would not hear me, because it is a stiff-necked people. And how is the Lord speaking through His servants, the prophets, man? Okay. The Lord ain't beaming down and telling you that you're an Israelite. Okay, just just out of out of the blue, He ain't just just doing that. Okay, it's through the Spirit. It says, "But in the land of their captivities, they shall remember themselves." Okay, and we're in the land of our captivities, man. Okay, wherever you are, and shall know that I am the Lord their God, for I will give them an heart and ears to hear. And they shall praise me in the land of their captivity and think upon my name. So that's the if if a man okay is saying the name Yahweh by Shimyao Shah, which the what the scriptures say, man. Okay. Malachi one and fourteen, but cursed be the deceiver. Which have in his flock a male and vows and sacrifice unto the Lord a corrupt thing, for I am the for I am a great king, saith the Lord of hosts. And my name is dreadful among the heathen. So a heathen ain't gonna be able to utter and, and call upon the name of Yahweh by Shimyao Shah, man. Okay? So if a man is thinking upon the name Yahweh by Shimyao Shah, and his spirit is resonating and agreeing with what we're saying. It's not a a, 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 a another nation that's an Israelite. It says, and return from their stiff neck and from their wicked deeds. For they shall remember the, the way of their fathers which have sent before me. And I will bring them again into the land which I, have, I promised with, with an oath unto their fathers, Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. And they shall be lords of it, and I will and I will increase them, and they shall be they shall not be diminished, and I will make an everlasting covenant with them to be their God, and they shall be my people, and I will no more drive my people of Israel out of the land that I have given them. Okay. So you know I should be okay, your endless genealogies, okay, your your um ancestry all that all of that stuff is is a scam this all is is based off of faith man okay yeah i know my i bet personally barely know my father my father my father passed away i never had the opportunity to really get to know his, his side of the, the the family okay but this truth resonates with me and other brothers too man that that didn't have their parents there in order to, to um help them out, okay, along this path or even teach them this this truth, man. Okay. So with that man, I wanna say uh Salawan.